What's going on guys, Victor here, and in today's Tackle Tuesday, I'm gonna show you guys my favorite lures to be thrown off Florida Piers. So starting with the Rapala x -Rap. this lure works really good for snook, tarpon, jacks, mackerel, bonita, it catches them all. Has a really nice wobble, you can reel it with a straight retrieve. This is a bigger size, a size 14. It has a really nice wobble to it. This is a spook made by Head On. This is a top water lure, and it's gonna be a walk the dog style action. Catch kingfish on this as well, mackerel, jacks, tarpon, ladyfish. This will catch almost everything that there is at piers. This right here is a diamond jig. I really like these when it's windy because you can cast them really far. You work them right on top of the water. They kill bonitas in the summertime. They kill big jacks and kingfish. If I do make a recommendation, I do recommend getting the, uh, the J trailer hook instead of the treble hook. You're gonna miss a lot less fish and your hookup ratio is gonna be a lot better. You're not gonna pull as many hooks. And the reason I say that this has worked really well on windy days is because it's heavy and it's able to cut through the wind. Now, when you're talking about finesse and you wanna catch stuff like mackerel, pompano, little baby snook, stuff that you can really play around with, and when it's not too windy, this is a spro jig. These are really, really super lifelike. They have a nice glide in the water just like that. They really resemble like a little pilchard or a glass minnow. These kill mackerel. These are made by spro. The best and cheapest jig you will ever buy and throw it up here is a crappie jig. You can buy these at Bass Pro. This is a 1 8 ounce crappie jig. It's white. It's really simple. You just pop it. You can pop it off the bottom. You can do a straight retrieve. These kill the mackerel. Okay, so next here I have Doc's Goofy Jigs. This is a yellow one. And this is a yellow one painted with white. And it has a trailer hook. So these really are good for pompano. The way you work them is, is you cast out, and you just pop them off the bottom, you let them sink. They'll usually hit it when it's sinking on the way down. Pop it, pop it, pop it, let it sink on the way down. When the pompon are around, make sure you're throwing some of these. Um, when it's windier, you get a northeast wind. These will work really well. Spoons, another really good lure. These are really good lures for fish that have teeth. Ladyfish love them, mackerel, kingfish, bluefish. Um, one recommendation I would make though is these don't work too well on high line piers because of the way that the angle is. These got to skip on top of the water and especially when it's windy they don't work too well. But if you're on a low line pier, especially a lot of you west coast guys, it just glides through the water and that low line pier, there's not much of an angle from your rod tip down to the water. So fish these on low line piers, really good for mackerel. And lastly, my favorite go-to jig, I grew up fishing Deerfield Pier and this is the Deerfield Pier Special. This is a gotcha lure, 7 8 ounce. All it is is this shiny metal body. It's got a lead head and it's got two treble hooks. So the way that you work this lure is you do a steady retrieve with a popping action. And what it does is the lure actually walks side to side like this. But unlike a top water, you can actually work it mid-water call. You can let it sink all the way to the bottom, pop it up and down. And these Unlike any other lure, if you've ever been pier fishing and you're frustrated because the guy next to you is killing something, it's usually because he's fishing this. These kill the mackerel. I've, caught, I've also seen plenty of giant kings caught on these, and these just kill fish. All right, guys, that was the video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you have any questions on how to work these lures, where to buy them, or whatever else may be, make sure to comment below. Don't forget to like the video, and yeah, I'm talking to you right there on the keyboard who's about to click away from this video without liking it. Like the video, and please do me a huge favor, go down to the description box below and there's a link to our Facebook page. We post a lot of stuff on there that you won't see on this channel, including pics, and it is a really easy way to contact me, or Brooke, or anyone else on this channel. If you guys have any questions, you can ask us directly on there comment on our wall, send us a DM on that Facebook page. So once again, go down to the link below in the description box and like that Facebook page. All right, till the next one guys, peace.